To install an M.2 SSD into your PS5 Slim, lay the console on a flat surface facing away from you, and take off the top panel by prying the top left corner in an upward motion. Remove this screw here with a Phillips head screwdriver. Take off the metal cover, and inside you'll see on the far right, we have another screw and the standoff. We're going to need these, so take that out and set it to the side. Take your SSD and size it up with the screw holes. When you've figured out what size you have, take the standoff and place that in the correct position. Place your SSD into the bay at a slight angle, making a soft connection on the left side. Push in until you hear a click. The drive should be lined up and slightly hovering over the standoff. Now we can thread in the screw. Replace the M2 cover and thread back in the screw with the tiny PlayStation button symbols. To put the top cover back on, line up the rear clips first, then rest the panel down, and apply pressure to the top left. When you power up your PS5, the console will format the drive and check the speed to make sure it's compatible. After that, you're good to go. If you're still in the market for an SSD, the description will have a list of drives that are PS5 compatible with the heatsink included, so that way they're completely plug and play like you saw here. You can also buy compatible SSDs without heatsinks and add them after the fact. That's a good option too if you can get a better deal. These drives and heatsinks will be linked down below. Just make sure you properly install those heatsinks with thermal pads as well.